So we're now joined by members of the Polish American Engineers Association and George Suwala is here. George, welcome to WEDU. Great to have you here. Thank you. What's the purpose of the organization? Uh, we assist uh, high school and university students. Uh, in, in building robots? Yeah, among mm -hmm. other things. Uh, so, uh, for example, we have here uh, two teams from Palm Harbor University High School, uh, which we sponsor. Uh, one of the teams have uh, won Florida championship, the other have placed second. So we have two best teams in Florida. They have also qualified to world championships and have just competed two weeks ago in Houston, Texas. They have placed number 14 and 25 out of over 60,000 students competing on 6,000 teams from around the world. So, so some of the top robotic students in the country right here at Palm Harbor. Right uh, here. Okay, so let me have you, the three of you introduce each other, uh, eat, or introduce yourselves. Uh, my name's Anna, and as a part of the club, I work on um, documentation, which is met in um, documenting the whole uh, design process of the robot. I'm Paulina, I work on mechanical design, which is building the physical robot itself. Um, and I'm Matt, I work on programming, and I program the robot in Java. Okay, so let's see what some of these robots can do. Uh, you want to explain what we're about to see? Yeah, so um, every year then there's a new set of objectives that, and that we have to do. So uh, one of the, objective, the objectives this year was to collect these uh, foam blocks, which we call glyphs, and um, stack them around in patterns called ciphers. Um, and if, if you put them into patterns, you, you, you get more points. And then uh, uh, something else a robot can also do is collect the, the, uh, the, a figure, which is called a relic. And it can pick it up and then put it over a barrier that is, a, that is 36 inches away from the barrier itself. That, that's incredible. Now, how did you get your start? Uh, what was the thing, what was your first childhood toy when you, when you got childhood toys? Um, for me personally, it was Legos, and then I, com I competed in the first um, the Lego League, which is a junior version of the uh, division that we compete in now. I also originally started with Legos and then moved on to RC cars and other things, and then when I joined the club, I went right into the whole Tetris building. Yeah, so I started um, by writing my own apps. Um, so in middle school, I sort of self-taught myself um, software development and um, application programming. So that's and, where I started. Robots are one of the fastest growing fields in the country. What, what, what's your highest hope? What, what do each of you want to do eventually uh, with your skills? Um, so I'd love to be a software engineer um, for one of the, the big companies, one of the, the that's um, leading um, the next revolution. Um, I'd love to be a biomedical engineer. Um, I want to be either a, a chemical engineer or a, um, a, a uh, aeronautical engineer. Well, that, incredible aspirations. And George, how does the uh, society, your uh, Polish American Engineer Society, help these kids do what they're uh, doing? We help them primarily financially, but uh, there are also uh, people who have help them on technical aspects. All right. Well, it's really terrific. And, and all three of you told me ahead of time that you want to go to some of the top universities in the country. Yes. Right? That's where you're aiming at. Yeah. MI, I heard MIT mentioned. Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 All right. Well, congratulations. I mean, this is really quite a project. And, and you know, Thanks. when I was growing up, all we had was Legos to play with. And that was your start.